and we record. All right, we'll see what happens. Got a random we'll two. Yeah. yeah, these guys are pretty decent. 60, 70 percent win rates. Maybe they're pub stompers. Who knows? Well, there's only one way to find out. Yeah, and that's by losing oh, horribly. Well, from how badly I've been playing today, it looks like I'm boosted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also gonna bring small to their backside. Yeah. Yeah, put one by the town, one by the backside. Do, 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 do. All right. We will see what happens. I hope you have the speakers ready. What do you mean? Right at Valkyries. <laughs> oh. The twin Hueys. Oh, jeez. Alright. Oh, guys, I Where's my hawk? Alright, so we put a hawk back here. Pack up your gear, folks. We're moving again. At your service, sir. At the ready, sir. Alright, they got helicopters. Go ahead, so I'm probably gonna buy a deagle to handle this. Mm-hmm. That's a good idea. Yeah, now you're coming down. Yep. I actually so, really like that 50 point kilo. You need to put in it back. Yeah, I got rid of the longbow in my deck. It's just not panning out. <laughs> it just isn't, man. Where's this fucking chaparral? God damn. This is when you know that you're fucked, when your Abrams gets hit. My, uh... Okay, my, my V, I'm just gonna leave them running and hopefully I'm just gonna pray that they won't get hit by anything. My Abrams got shot at a lot. Hopefully he's still alive, I guess. Okay, get recon. Alright, so they're gonna have control of a lot of territory at the start. They are indeed. But they lost a good amount of stuff at the start, too. Because of their choice to do this. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Shit. Hey, hey. Oh no, my Dark Force is already dying to a BT-19. This is typical. These LVTPs are so fun to use. They're just <laughs> so scary. Someone call for a cab? You got something for me?
make uh let me know what you need and if you need anything from me. Okay. I should be okay, I think, but I try getting a long bow. See that. See how long it takes to die. Yeah. <laughs> the choices, man. The choices. I know. Is someone in the, inter in the infantry fight, which isn't something I say very often when I'm playing US. Man, why is my Abrams telling me that I can't fire? Make sure that you get units over here so that, because I just shot a BTR-80 in the butt and it didn't kill it. Yeah. I'm gonna need to get fire support vehicles next. T90S on the field. Hey, hey. Who do you want us to trap? This will inspire it position, sir. Are you talking to me? What can the infantry do for you, sir? Let's rock it. Yeah, BMs are so fucking good for their price point too. It's ridiculous the amount of shit that these guys get.
Do you okay over there? Do you want anything? What? Do you need anything over there? Nah, just continue to wreck your guy. The dream. I'm definitely at point advantage over him, so... Okay. Whereas... Yeah. yeah, if you want to, just buy CVs. That's actually how you could help. I'll get one when I've uh, got enough points next time. Oh, I bought a second M1A2, cool. CV's gonna be back there. Yep, I see him. Right, I'll buy a CV to count the cap that. Holy, what the hell was that? Bertino, yay! Everyone's favorite unit to deal with. Although it's actually not too bad. Not too bad is usually quite a relative term in these sorts of situations, though. Sort of. Might be able to get a good. Okay, yep. Yeah. Oh, he shot first? What? Like Han Solo. It always comes down to the infantryman and his rifle. Yes, sir. Oh boy, here comes the. Unload your CV. And then get one for Echo. New Bertino launch. Gonna miss your uh, CV. Mostly. Hope it doesn't get one shot, let's put it that way. Yeah. Alright, find a Nighthawk. How's your side doing? Not too bad, thank you.
the hell did my Nighthawk do? Thought I told it to hit that spot. He did his best. That's what he did. Uh. Depressing. by Patriot in a couple minutes. Or a couple seconds rather. Side's getting pushed. Does it bounce be really painful? Somewhat. Yep. Very painful. There's a B over here as well. Where's the BU? On this right hand side. I might be able to kill it with my longbow though, so. We'll see, because I had a, okay. a long range piece of air there. But they, they just um, managed to get. I think it was like a mortar or something. Killed my. Uh, killed my chaparral. This happened. Maybe you should get good. Maybe I should get good. You're not wrong. Jesus Christ, yucky all day. Big twenty seven coming in. Lab scout B B B to BRDM three. Incredible. That's real life. No, it, it's some sort of dream probably. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? A T90S fires faster. Jesus. Thank goodness, survive. Lost a lot of big tanks, jeez. <laughs> Did 
Did I just one-shot that PD? Where did that PD get other damage from? I don't know. No, at least we're ticking points because um, my side's a bit of a stalemate at the moment. Me killing stuff, them killing stuff, and then just rinse and repeat. Yeah, that's, yeah, same here. It's ridiculous, the amount of shit going on here. No, longbow, okay. Fuck, that's a dead Abrams. Oh, thank goodness, stunned it. Keep sacrificing units. You're losing it for stupid reasons. That's um, quite the Cobra attack. <laughs> Losing a lot of units, can't sustain this. <laughs> Let's see. What's the area like on the left hand side? Kinda weak. PD out. What is it you want this? I can probably get that BM with a Nighthawk, I guess. Alright, yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. I mean, a girl. Yeah, perfect. Thank you. No problem at all. Yeah, at least, I mean, at least um, we've got a okay, we're contesting Delta, because like I said, my side is uh, just a stalemate. They could probably counter cut me if they wanted to, actually. After the fiasco with the... Uh, Here comes a smirch. Okay, it doesn't mean that they get killed or anything, right? Apart from my car transport. <laughs> Rest in peace, smirch. brave soul. SD25 on the field. Yeah, that's our range from the picture, unfortunately. Hopefully, I can panic it. Oh, one shot him! Oh! My oh. God. <laughs> that was disgusting. Beautiful. Just what I needed. Right, I'm gonna mark that single screen bomb in a second. I oh, know he's moving it, I think. Okay. Or not. Nice. Oh, never mind, you got it. <laughs> nice hit. 
UM gets side shot, booyah. BU on the field. Shit. I'm gonna go in with a Nighthawk. Uh, see if you can keep it spotted. That would be great. That's gonna be difficult. It's not gonna be spotted for long. Oh shit, he's leaving it there. GG. <laughs> the yeah, plane that's train. Right. <laughs> that was just a little bit overkill right there, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. It's alright, we needed to kill it. Had to make sure it died. We did need to kill it, you're right. Okay, he's gonna surrender. This was a good game, although yeah. I... Like AD was, uh, was okay. It was easy. That went pretty well. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your support. You did really well on your side. Yeah. He didn't make me fight on like a large front. He let me focus. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Longbow would have been nice, but you know what? I would have lost it to a Tunguska because I'm terrible with it. Well, that's what happened with mine. <laughs> yeah, ex exactly. Like, you know what? It it just it isn't worth the fact that you know that they're gonna you're gonna bait out a couple units, but it's like I'd rather just get a fifty point recon chopper and I'll have more versatility with it. The thing with mine was I knew that the Tunguska was there because I'd seen it before, before the whole um, complete mess up with um, like when they killed my my um, Jaffrel and my whatever else it was, my Pivads, and then they just drove like three Hallies right on top of my M182 and just killed it. <laughs> um, yeah. It's very <laughs> sad. But, yeah. um, and then I knew where it was. I knew he hadn't moved it, and then I I. Um, I mortared exactly where it was, and I hit. I hit it though. I definitely hit because it, it was stunned. Um, as my longbow went in to try and kill the um, T8U or T72BU even, and then like while panicked, the Tunguska fires two missiles and hits both of them and kills my longbow. Yeah, that's <laughs> just ridiculous. Because so I even tried to like want to. I, I nearly got into range basically, but it just wasn't. It wasn't to be. I think MVP was my Patriot one shotting a <laughs> SU-25. Well, my Patriot one shot a, a PD, and I'm not entirely sure how that happened. <laughs> Why? As if it criticals, it does a one shot. Like well, you I know it. it's just it's just it's disgusting. <laughs> but I mean, any any seven, eight, nine damage weapon will do it. Yeah. All right, let's go check out that replay. Make the recording even longer than it should be. Look at it really freaking quick. Uh, really quick cast of the game. Let's see. What are they bringing? Helicopter invasion. So he had a lot of high points without territory. Oh, they brought a K-52. Who would have known? You like the BM? That unit is too effective for 90 points. It's pretty crazy. I think I do. I do like it. That's for sure. Well, yeah, I mean, it's not a 90-point tank, it's more like 105 at least. 120, probably. Well, the missile is just, like, it's so good that you get both that and the missile. It's just really nice. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to take the longbow on my deck as well, so I can avoid that. <laughs> I can avoid it ever happening again. This is why I get the HA. It beats BMs. It takes multiple on at once. doesn't care. Fodder units moving up. They get to kick the... GRU out. Killed his helicopters relatively for free. See now if he brought his helicopters off to the side, he really would have wrecked some havoc. Wreaked some havoc, who knows? Can't say anything anymore. There would have been some havoc of some description. <laughs> what havoc, but exactly. Havoc. <laughs> Dude, this guy only had one two AA pieces, a Tunguska and a Shilka on the other side that I saw the Shilka and I knew the Tunguska was there. Ridiculous. I lost my recon Bradley because I'm an idiot, leading off with that when I knew he had GRU in the field. What a dope.
Yeah, that H.A. Abrams was pretty helpful back where it was. Yours, on the other side of the ro road. I should have brought a, well, an EGS. But then I realized I had such a nice possession onto the side of um, the, the Delta Forest. Yeah, that, that's why you keep that. You, you cut reinforcements by taking that area. That's oh, why I couldn't... With a K on the other side. Right. Yeah, yeah. I like how my small, a BTR-90 killed them all. Poor guys. BTR-90, pretty good. I could have sent a freaking helicopter around him and all the way to his back and I could have killed the CV. Instead I bring the DAP back to my base. Uh, it's pretty funny how little happened at Echo. Like this guy brought... He brought so much yakware. The poor bastards, those conscripts, they got raped. <laughs> They, they actually did though, like they just kept looking at it, like I kept mortaring them, you just kept mowing them down, like one Yakurei squad after the other. It was actually quite disgusting. And this guy's Buratino really didn't do much. It killed maybe a couple infantry squads, but it didn't get anywhere near its 140 points worth, nor did it get the resupply worth. 49% miss. Panicked versus worried. Big difference, wow. Yeah, yeah that's weird. Down all those small smalls. And so I left the other squad where it was. Oh, dude, you were doing an offensive similarly? Oh, god. I don't even want to look. Yes, uh, don't look, don't look. Two squads of Dallas Force just got chewed up, and I, I was just like, okay, well, I'm just going to keep going because <laughs> like, my tag was too far back to kill it, and it was, it was sad. Well, you should have told me about it. My small could have moved up. They could have killed it. They needed cannon fodder, though. I remember when Delta Force had cannon fodder. <laughs> <laughs> they're 25 points. They're they're about as uh, expensive as VDV. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cannon fodder. <laughs> For America. <laughs> American cannon fodder. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I, I'd rather have Rifleman 90 than Delta Force on my front line. That's the worst part. Oh, okay, this is my mistake. I didn't actually see this at the time. It was a VDB 90 squad that killed my Chaparral, actually. Hmm. Oh, flanking, okay. Yeah, yeah. And they just piled on with those three helicopters in the B, which is quite sad. I'm really happy that this lab scout be a beat the BRDM 3. <laughs> so oh, impressed. Happens. It really doesn't yeah, happen. like that was so rare. So impressed. It's a really nice Nighthawk strike where I got an absolute ton of stuff actually. On your side? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this guy, he bought too many units and didn't do anything with them. Like, he had Yakuare, but didn't have his tanks or fire support with him. He well, used. The thing was the guy on my side never attacked. Yeah, but I mean that's kind of standard. These guys probably are stompers. Like they can't handle aggression. I definitely didn't amazingly, but I was the one who was constantly attacking. Like he didn't attack once on this side. I don't know how he expects to neutralize Golf if he just sits in Charlie. But... The end. They never bought a CV for Echo. Mm -hmm. Your Nighthawk strike killing that tank in Echo helped me out big time. Because I didn't want to trade a shot with the H.A. Abrams, yeah. it would have taken like half its armor or life. Oh, the SU-25 that's going to get wrecked by the Patriot. I gotta see that. Is this the time though? I don't know. Yes, it is the time. He looks like he's in for the clear, and bam! Boosh. <laughs> the one shot from downtown. <laughs> Patriots. Yeah, that shit's awesome. Yeah, this guy put four Yakuade squads just to hold the line, but he had no fire support for them. Like, that defeats the purpose of Yakuade. I mean, the reason that you have Yakuade is just so they soak up enemy fire. 
Yeah, but there's no fire support to kill the stuff killing them. That's the whole point. Yeah, it's just a waste of Yokodai. Yeah. Which, I mean, they are. <laughs> oh, here's the best part. I brought a 35 point chopper and killed the UM. Oh my god. Right here. Two side shots with small. Fantastic. I was really lucky that he didn't use his main cannon on it. It's aiming, I tell the helicopter to go up before... Oh, he misses. Okay. Lucked out. Because that could have killed the squad. That was a pretty big pickup for me. Nighthawk shooting at a spot that I thought his shit was, but it's not. Hmm, another vanishing uh, explosive. Maybe? Two... maybe. Yeah, these guys just rely on the BM. H.A. Abrams is a pretty good tank to beat that shit. Everyone else's 100 point stuff. But it's really hard to keep it alive. Planes and infantry. I mean, like, like the difference in, in sort of how that game went compared to that one and when we were playing Pound and Fast, like it's so easy to tell the difference in mentality. Oh, yeah. Um, like, like when, when I was playing as Pan and he like noticed that I'd you know, to be fair it was my fault for for not being careful enough with my AA. With my AA should I say. But um like with this guy, he killed he killed an M one A two, he killed a load of stuff that I'd pushed up. Because once the AA was down, he just rolled in with the helis. But like when Pat did that, he like he literally assaulted like the second afterwards and just was relentless. Just kept yeah. coming. Guy he he gets like this massive advantage for the moment. And then just sort of sit still and lets me just bring stuff up. It's really. It just shows, I think, like the difference between good and. Well, not, not bad, but good and kind of average players. Yep. Okay. Thanks for watching. You just watched the whole entire game plus the replay of it. <laughs> good night. <laughs>